Hello awesome people, welcome to Smartphone Tutorials. Today we're going to look at the installation of Mocky OS on the Redmi 4A. Let's begin. Now the prerequisites for this is obviously you need to have an unlocked bootloader because you will need a custom recovery that is TWRP. Now if you really want to know how to do that or maybe how to unlock the bootloader or how to root and install TWRP, the video links are mentioned in the description. This is a golden Redmi 4A Indian variant and you need to download Mocky OS and Google Apps. So the links are mentioned in the description. Just download those files copy to the internal memory of your phone and then follow the instructions on the screen so first things first we need to wipe everything so back up all your data and also ensure you have at least 50 percent battery so delvic cache data and system do not wipe internal storage because that's where the files are located next up you need to go to install select the Moki os file and select open g apps or google apps now obviously you know as always this installation will take about three to five minutes so please be patient while all the files are flashed i'll get back to you once the flashing is done All right, so once the files are flashed, we will just wipe cache in Dalvik and we will reboot system. So the first boot will take long, say about five to seven minutes as always with almost all the phones on all the ROMs. Now, while the phone is booting, let me just give you a quick heads up. Now, this is a very, very early build that we are talking about. Uh, I'm not sure if the sources are still out for this particular device. As far as I know, Xiaomi haven't released the source code for this particular device. Now, the stable ROM or the official MIUI ROM is based on 6.0. So the developers have managed to get uh, Android 6.0 based Moki OS and Lineage OS booting and working. Now, what's not working, the critical things like voice over LTE is not present and geo 4g voice doesn't work so a geo sim for calling doesn't work at all but apart from that the good thing is that wi-fi is working camera is working video recording is working all the basic functionalities are working so you know if you're someone who likes to you know try different things on your phone and you want to give moki os a try then this is your chance just pack up everything follow the instructions flash this particular ROM and you know if you're not using Geo or if you don't use a sim which uses voice over LTE trust me you'll enjoy using this ROM now I did use this phone for a day with this particular ROM and I what I noticed is it is way more smoother than MIUI and uh, you know all the custom features or all the advanced features of Moki OS are there now obviously this is an unofficial build so you will not be getting over the air updates but yes, this was, you know, this, this is just a quick preview of this ROM. I'm waiting for all the bugs to be fixed so that I can do a detailed review of each and every custom ROM, just like I did for the Redmi Note 4. Now, apart from that, uh, some highlights of this ROM, as you already know, it comes with the CM theme engine. So you can choose to install different themes. Let's go to settings now. You can see Wi Fi is working, Bluetooth, SIM cards are not inserted, but yes, everything works fine, including calling apart from voice over LTE. That is the theme engine that you have there. You can download different themes from the Play Store. And apart from that, we have system profile, status bar customization. You know, you can customize from battery percentage to the look of the tiles and everything. This is a pre rooted firmware, so you don't have to root manually. Mocky Center. This is where you would normally see the OTA or the over the air updates if it's an official version. So there you have it. There was a quick preview and installation method for Mocky OS on the Redmi 4A. Do not forget to subscribe and if you like this video 
like share and stay tuned for more amazing videos